Good morning, Gemini. Welcome to your weekly horoscope for the week of July 31st through August 6th. I've decided to make this one more about career, the workplace, that type of thing, a little bit of advice for prosperity, abundance, but more focused on career and workplace. Okay, so I'm going to pull a card to see what's going on, like what influences are going on in the workplace <clears throat> no matter where you work work dynamics differ but there's always some sort of a workplace dynamic I'm gonna pull a couple cards to see like what's going on right now maybe anything you need to know we'll see what comes up a card over here to see what like if you were to attend to this internal aspect it would improve your career your workplace okay and then just some advice general advice on workplace prosperity luck abundance bringing all that in okay <clears throat> so let's get started what's going on with Gemini right now at work hmm okay so either you are taking some sort of a leave or while you're there you're not actually there so you don't put all of your all into what you're doing every day right now um and it there's no mystery why it's not a mystery as to why you know why um lack of communication Things are just kind of stagnant, bored, boredom, those type of things. Okay? That's what's kind of happening in and around the workplace, the efforts you put into work, all of that. <coughs> what else do we have going on right now? You'll have to excuse me. This is, it's like 8 o'clock in the morning. It's my first reading of the day. Okay. What's going on with you? Um, okay so it's all good things this is like a pregnant pause is kind of what they call it it's just a time for the momentum to catch up to whatever it is that you have been working towards okay so maybe you're a little bit detached because you are not seeing the results that you want to see right now but what it's saying is that um let uh, news is coming soon um <clears throat> i don't know my fucking throat news is coming soon but what's happening is there is a block in communication okay so i'm not there's nothing good bad nothing i'm just stating what's going on okay Okay, and also, there's something, hmm, so you're making changes in the workplace, your career, those type of things, you're working towards something, achieving something, maybe getting a new position, promotion, something along the lines in what you're doing. However, there is a couple of things or a thing that is extremely annoying that you're trying to phase out but you haven't done it yet. So you're just a little bit disagreeable um, because of the fact that you're not seeing the results that you wanna see yet, what's happening is you are kind of becoming complacent, stagnant, bored, those type of things. And you kind of get nitpicky in those moments and at those times, okay? So if you were to um, nurture, pay attention to, shine light on any aspect of your internal world that would help you in your career this week, it would be Nutrition. So, here, let me show you. Food. Feed yourself. Feed yourself right. <clears throat> Feed yourself according to what your tastes, what your needs are. Uh, not so much uh, according to the people around you. Don't just kind of, yeah, whatever, we'll eat whatever. 
if they pick somewhere, like if you don't have control over where you go to eat, <clears throat> then choose something there that is more to your palate, not to somebody else's. Okay? You need to pay attention to, if you were to pay attention to these things, it would make you a little less grumpy when you're needing to put that energy into your workplace. Okay? And this is all for this week. So this isn't forever. I'm just stating what's going on. The advice overall for you is aspire. Find photos of the place you would like to work or sketch it. Stick these images on a special board and look at them every day. Draw the business card that you hope to have one day and pin that on the board too. Know that it will soon be yours. So what you want, it's coming towards you. You just have to have faith and a little bit of patience, okay? And and it doesn't mean that there's nothing to do right now because obviously there's certain things that you need to be working on right now to make everything that you want in the future come together. This is just... <clears throat> things that you could be doing right now okay and um hold on i'm sorry because i just want to make sure i'm getting all the messages to you i could feel a little bit of anxiety so still make sure that you're participating in everything that's going on do not stand back and um, let somebody else make all the decisions right now. Don't be a pushover. Participating in your life every single day is what is going to bring in everything that's coming to you. I say it's already yours because you've already put in work for it. There's just a couple of little things that you have to continue to do to maybe internally learn some things before what's coming in your outside existence actually makes it. Okay? So that way you're like ready for it. All right. I hope that helped. Um, I love you. I will talk to you next week. Bye.